taking a little lunch break here. I'm with uh, Luna today. We're going on a hike. Here we go up to, uh, we're on the Swift Creek Trailhead. We're going to go up to Granite Lake. This is similar to a hike uh, I did last year. I really wanted to have Luna with me then. I should have taken her. So we're going to repeat a little bit of that trip. Go up to that lake tonight, uh, do some fishing, cook some food, camp, hang out, right? And then tomorrow, we'll, we'll stay there for a bit and probably come back down Swift Creek and check out the creek for a bit. Luna's pretty uh, excited about the amount of rivers and lakes there are here. So it should be fun times. It's supposed to rain a little bit tonight, maybe, and then definitely tomorrow night. So we'll see how, uh, how we do with the rain. No thunderstorms or anything, so that's a good thing. But um, yeah, it's nice. 70 degrees out. I'm freaking starving. It's, what is it, noon? Exactly noon. So it's lunchtime. What are we going to have? It's gorp, crackers, cheese, good stuff. You already had breakfast. You ate a lot this morning. You're very wet and dirty already. It took about three seconds for you to get dirty. We've got a variety of things here for lunch today. We do a little bit of gorp, good old peanuts. Just had a little crunchy bar, and I really like these. This is a um, bar uh, called the Layered Fruit Bar, strawberry banana. You can get like a huge pack of these at Costco. They're fun little chewy things, nice and sweet. I use it kind of as a dessert. Oh, it's pretty good. What do you think, Luna? There's a big spider on that camera. Made to Granite Lake, have a pretty epic uh, view behind us. Got a nice campsite, uh, kind of close to the one I used last time, but this one's not next to the water, which kind of stinks, but I can go up on this rock formation and fish all over there, so that'll work pretty great. But awesome, awesome view. Um, got a nice, nice big fire ring. There's already some limbs down here. We brought a little saw, so I'll saw those up and have a little tiny campfire tonight. Luna looks a little tired. She's laying down, taking a nap. I'm gonna set up the tent and then probably throw up a tarp. Looks like it's threatening to rain. So it'd be nice to have that up. For today, we've got the Nemo Dragonfly 2. My two-person tent I usually use with Kelsey, but uh, since we've got Luna here, I figured it'll be a better solution than trying to cram us into my little tiny mid. I knew I wasn't doing any crazy hiking, so I'm not terribly concerned about the little bit of extra weight. But it's a good tent. It's a little breezy, so I'm gonna set it up. And uh, I'll probably chill for a little bit and set up a tarp, get some firewood going, and uh, we're gonna hit the fishing up. We 
We're chilling out here underneath the tarp. Um, got old blue set up right here. It's kind of a little windy, titch bit on the sprinkly side. So we're gonna chill out here for a little bit. Luna, yes, I'm petting you right now. You pet me, I pet you. Yeah. So we're gonna chill out here for a little bit. Um, the wind and a little bit of rain stops, and then I'm gonna go try some fishing. There we go. Nice size rainbow. That looks pretty freaking awesome. Look at that thing. That is a nice looking fish. Made it back to the tent, did a little fishing, but uh, wind kicked up and <laughs> started uh, sprinkling pretty hard on me. I also got a little buddy right here. Hi, Luna. Somebody's tired. They've had a big day. So I did catch that one rainbow. I'm pretty sure it's a rainbow. Nice fish. That's That was equally in size to the what I think is a rainbow that I caught out of this lake last year. It was uh, hit maybe on like the fifth or sixth cast. I didn't, I didn't cast very much. It was not ideal conditions. So, but I'm pretty happy I got that. Um, it is... 5.45, we get dark around 8.30. I'm gonna sit in the tent and chill for a little while longer and I'm hoping the rain kind of stops and then we'll go out and make some dinner and get a little fire going if uh, if it's not too windy. Ooh, I could use a nap. Sit rep, the uh, dog doesn't want to eat. She keeps trying to just nuzzle her food into the dirt. So I don't know what what's up with that strange behavior. Um, I'm very, very, very agitated right now with Sawyer. I have no idea why, but this thing is like dribbling out. I tried to back flush it. I don't have the syringe, but you can take the cap off of this and put this and you can squeeze. I'm squeezing as hard as I possibly can. It is just the most minuscule dribble. So I don't understand, like it was fine. Like this water is a little turbid. Like I'll, I'll give you that, it's not perfect, but it's like, it's so bad right now. Like I basically, it took me like 10 minutes to get this much water. This thing is completely garbage. I, I 100,000 gallons is is a complete and total false falsity. There's no way. I've used this this particular one for maybe a year, and it's completely just like doesn't work anymore. I, I don't. And every time I, I take it home, I back flush it, I dry it. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm pretty agitated right now because I'm sitting here and I have like this much water and it was exhausting to get you know a quarter of a liter it took me 10 minutes to get and so i'm just sitting here with no water basically i'm not gonna drink that stream i have no idea why it's going so slow and it's the big one too like the big one should flow better than the small one the o-ring's in there got the o-ring that's not the issue it's just here watch this watch i will squeeze as hard as i can It's just like barely coming out. It's so incredibly slow. Someone needs to make a better system. Got some food in me. I feel way better as always. Brought the uh, Falmeven F1. Decided to bring an actual knife this time. Figured it might be cold and I want to make a fire. So we're gonna Make a uh, make a little fire here. I found this nice piece of pine. It's uh, make some wicked uh, shavings with it. You can see right over my face. You can see them all nice curls. And I got a little stuff sack down here. Just dropping them all into this little stuff sack. Try to keep them dry off the ground. Man, this is soft. If I can get them to stay attached, that's ideal. Versus going every which way. There. Looks pretty good. Alright, good stuff. Put up a nice little bundle here. I got some thin sticks. I get a Enough of these build up, you don't start a fire super easy. Well, we have retreated to the tent. It is uh, continuing to sprinkle and rain uh, pretty much nonstop. 
uh, windy, cold, did get the fire going, which was uh, nice to have. But I'm chilling here. It's about 7.45. It should get dark in about uh, another 45, 50 minutes. So here she is, she's pretty tired. She's got the sit pad underneath her to give her some insulation. I might drape her with my down jacket just to keep her a little bit warmer. She was fine. Um, last time I took her camping was with Kelsey and I think it got down to like 22 degrees and she was fine. I think the low tonight's supposed to be like 39. So she should be plenty warm enough. Um, hope I'm warm enough. I'm, it's it's dank, it's, it's just damp and, and chilly and bleh. <laughs> At least I caught one fish. That makes me feel like the the whole trip was worth it because Luna had fun and we had at least one fish caught. So we'll see what tomorrow morning looks like. I'm hoping for this like picture perfect, a little bit of sun in the sky, catch more fish, have a good breakfast, all that stuff. But fully prepared to wake up to uh, 10 mile an hour winds with gusts up to 20 miles an hour with sprinkles all over the place. So we'll see. Good morning, we just got up. Um, slept pretty, pretty good. It rained all last night. <laughs> it rained until about two or three o'clock in the morning and now there's just like mist fog that has moved in and um, it's just very damp. It's like, it's kind of what I always imagine uh, like Washington or Oregon forests kind of be like. And it is just like a solid blanket of mist out there. So everything's very, very wet right now. I'm gonna get everything I can packed up in the tent and then it's gonna be a GoPro for the rest of this day with as wet as it is out. Under the tarp now, I'm gonna have some breakfast. Um, it had that huge pool of water in it this morning. It's pretty funny, uh, but it's perfectly fine. Usually the lines just kind of stretch and the pressics get real tight. You loosen back up, it's no big deal. Uh, but I raised it back up. Uh, visibility is uh, pretty much zero right now. You can't really see anything. <clears throat> Are you eating some food? Yeah, your food's right there. Eat it. So we're going to eat a little bit of breakfast here. I'll tear down the tent, get everything packed up, and then I'm going to take the tarp and probably just end up strapping it basically to the top of the pack because uh, it's going to be the last thing that goes in there. All right, time for some awesome breakfast. I didn't really bring much, and I'm too lazy to cook, so I'm going to do just a plain old cliff bar and some gummy worms. Breakfast of champions. About 7.30, rolling out of camp. The uh, visuals have not changed. I still can't see more than 100 feet. Got my El Dorco rain gloves on. They are fishing Japanese fisherman gloves. They're recommended by Andrew Skirka. It's like 45, misting, kind of rainy. Try to keep the hands semi warm. We got about five miles to get out of here. Um, hopefully, it doesn't rain the entire way. But we'll see.
made it back to the car. Had a really, really fun trip. Um, it misted and rained and, and kind of sprinkled on us the entire way back. So I'm pretty wet. Luna's pretty wet too. I don't think it bothers her at all. She was jumping in the puddles in every stream uh, possible. So I don't think that was phasing her very much. But uh, we did we had a lot of fun. Um, I slept great last night. Luna slept pretty good. It was uh, windy, rainy. It was a really good test to um, see how she would do when it's just, uh, just the two of us out on a trip. So um, overall, a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun with the dog. Happy I caught a fish. Till next time. Luna, did you have fun? Are you ready for a nap? Dad ready, Dad's ready for some Wendy's.